three tips from my book, Is Your Child Ready to Face the World? The first, walk the talk. Parents quite often do not realize how perceptive children are, even very young children. Their eyes keenly observe, their ears intently hear, and their minds process what the environment has to offer. Sometimes a child will behave the way he'd seen his parent behave 10 or 15 years earlier. So it's important for parents to realize that talking alone is not enough. It's about walking the talk. If we want our children to behave in a particular fashion, we need to behave that way. The second tip, handling pressure better. Children these days find themselves living in a pressure cooker kind of atmosphere. There's so much pressure to excel in academics, perform well in other activities and be good at sports. And then there is this added peer pressure. Parents should not add on to this pressure, this pressure of performance. And it's actually very important for parents to handle pressure themselves a bit better so that their children can learn from it. It's important to feel off pressure. It's important to work over pressure, not under pressure. And the third tip is accepting flaws and mistakes. No parent is perfect, so how can we expect our children to be flawless? It's okay to have flaws. When we teach a child how to ride a cycle, we know that the child will fall. And it's only then that the child will learn how to ride a cycle. But we need to be there to lift the child, to pick up the child when he or she falls. So when a child makes a mistake, he or she should have the confidence that they can walk up to their parent and the parent will listen to them and will not be judgmental. This is a very important bridge that a child needs to walk on and it's important for the parents to sit with the child, understand what went wrong and learn from the mistake. It's a great learning experience. Every mistake teaches one a lot. We are also fortunate to be parents. We need to be grateful for this wonderful privilege that we have to be parents. Happy Children's Day.